Hey Dylan guys, welcome you back. Uh, today I wanted to share a kind of a, a secret I uncovered about why enriching others is so important and why contributing to others is so important. So I welcome you all with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Shri Nityananda Paramashivam. Um, so this is basically the click I had. And you've probably heard the beginning, which is the Zen story of the cup, right? When your cup of tea is full, then you can't receive anything else. So same thing goes with enriching. Whenever you live life, you will have some powerful cognitions. You will gain some... Life will bless you with some form of understanding, some form of skill. It will bless you with something. Once you have it, it's like the universe poured some tea in your cup. Then it is your responsibility to empty the cup. And how do you empty the cup? By sharing it with others. If you share your powerful cognition with others, if you share your skills, your expertise with others, if you share anything you have with others, you empty your cup. When you empty your cup, then you can receive more from the universe. It's not that the universe stops pouring. Universe is always pouring. But we are not, we do not live in the way that we can we can receive, we can imbibe everything that it is pouring. So when your cup is full and if you don't share, don't enrich, then everything else that the universe is pouring is just going to go waste. So that is one thing I realized. When you have to, ha you, you want to have deeper, more subtle, more powerful cognitions, you share the, power the cognitions you have now. You share that. By sharing that, you empty your cup and you will be able to download more and or receive more and more of these powerful cognitions the deeper more powerful uh, yeah so that's why um, it's such an important thing to enrich and we don't realize it uh, but if you constantly think about others and think about enriching others with whatever you have uh, it can be wealth it can be expertise it can be skills it can be powerful cognitions it can be food it can be anything but if you share you will be able to receive more and that is important for you to be uh, kept alive and to get out of the lower states of consciousness, to get out of these low emotion moods, these ups and downs we go through. Um, so to make these ups and downs redundant, if we constantly think about others and share with others, we allow the flow of life to happen, the rejuvenation. It's like creation is um, is happening. The, the, the universe is giving you, it's blessing you with some things. And then by sharing, you allow the rejuvenation process. It's like the destruction. You, you make it get out of your system so that you can receive new. And it's a flow. And it keeps happening because the universe is eternal auspiciousness. So, yeah, that's a powerful cognition I wanted to share with you guys. Inviting you to enrich. Um, inviting you to enrich with whatever you have. But starting to cognize the importance of enriching and not postponing because, oh, I don't know if I can do it. I don't know if it's worth sharing. Whatever you have, you start where you are and you keep moving forward. Again, small things on a regular basis, which leads to big results. Um, so with this, uh, I'm thanking you all for watching these videos, inviting you to like. Again, small thing that makes a big difference. Comment the same thing, small thing that makes a big difference, and subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Nidyanam. I welcome you all with my love and respect. Let you all open all your three eyes.